are soldiers heroes or victims in many traditions warriors were often seen as heroes in much post modern thought they are often seen as victims why victims because in today's world soldiers often become puppets in the self serving machinations of their political bosses while those leaders <clears throat> live in safety and even luxury in their plush bungalows they send soldiers to battle fields to wound or be wounded to injure or be injured and to kill or be killed what causes the war is not any moral imperative to protect society from evil but a political agenda to increase their own power no wonder society soldiers are seen as victims by those who know how and why political calculations work then why were soldiers seen as heroes in the past in the past too wars were many wars were fought for selfish purposes still the heads of state would lead the war of war effort from the front and many of these warriors were driven by a spirit of heroism it requires a heroic level of courage to be ready to enter into a battlefield knowing that <coughs> the next moment may be the moment may be the final moment of their life one's life the bhagavad gita lords fearlessness ideally soldiers were meant to be martial guardians of society and the bhagavad gita lords their fearlessness shauryam te jodhute daksham yuddhe chapya palayanam danam ishvara bhavascha kshatram karma swabhavajam apart from um, apart from the fact that some wars were truly fought for heroic purposes to protect kingdoms from tyrants who would plunder people and ravish women and massacre non combatants the praising of soldiers as heroes served a bigger purpose soldiers embody a sacrificing spirit whereby wherein they are ready to lay down their lives for their community or country even if that spirit even if the particular cause for which they are sacrificing is ill informed still the underlying sacrificing spirit sacrificing spirit is laudable every society human society if it is to flourish needs people who are willing to sacrifice in various areas of life by lauding the heroism of soldiers and seeing them as emblems of courage and sacrifice people in general are inspired to similar even if smaller acts of courage and sacrifice in their daily lives without such inspiration people will give given to their default tendency for self-centeredness and even exploitativeness and society will degenerate therefore whenever we see a sacrificing spirit in anyone be it soldiers rather than rather than deconstructing it 
to reduce them to victims to or to reduce the whole sacrifice to victimhood we can appreciate the underlying sacrificing spirit and use our intelligence to see if we could channel that sacrificing spirit in more constructive spiritually evolved direct directions